What did I say? <laughs> what did I fucking say? Oh boy, give me a second. For fuck's sake. Hi there, I'm Fluffy. Shush, we already know that. Wanted to bring the fucking coin. Right, I have no idea what the f where the hell I'm going, so... Yeah, this is totally not the place, I think. Oh well. What the hell with you? Oh, there it is. It's got up there, but not me. Oh. If only I had an M14 right now. What the? Oh. Uh, I... So what was the point of all that then? Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> you saved me! Yeah, now scram! <sighs> Alright. What the fuck? What the hell is that? Here's yeah, what that shaved dog there thing wanted anyways. What the hell is that? just blonde, just... What the hell is that artillery? I knew it! I knew it! They're stuck with their games and new tanks, those filthy communists! Gotta find them. Not today, Al-Qaeda. Not today. Where the hell am I now? <sighs> right. This coin looks like it's falling apart too. And that's not for the age of the game. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Great! You brought back the coin! I'll make sure it's put back in its proper place. Here's the next artifact you need to find. This scarab is a symbol of eternal life. What? And it's supposed to be in the pyramid exhibit on ancient Egypt. Could you bring it back to me? Okay, we'll be right back. Who the hell put it there? I think I know where it leads to. Oh, because the image of the wall, that's where it says. I just, I just took that one by random. We did it, boys. We defeated terrorism. This might be some... What the... There's... I knew it. On guard. Hmm. Well. Oh, it's much easier than I thought it was. Or maybe that's because I'm not that much of a good gamer. Oh no! Perfect. Why is he keep running around? I know I'm a hedgehog. But that's just stereotyping. Here's the scarab, Fluffy. What's next? Most excellent, my friend. Most. <laughs> the next misplaced artifact the? is a fossilized bone from the Jurassic dinosaur, Brachiosaurus. Yum! A giant bone! Sorry, fossils are actually hard as stone, so it won't taste very good. <laughs> Darn. We'll bring it back as soon as we can. You can tell the voice acting is top notch. Hmm. I hear Al Qaeda is nearby. I have no idea what kind of exhibit that was. I'm gonna guess that one. On guard. Take that, Fortnite. 
Oh, there it is. On guard, down. Or maybe with the Dark Souls. <laughs> All right. Off you go. I'm kind of wondering now if I play a game from what, like 2020 by now, 2019, yeah, a game from 19 years ago. Does it make that? Does it make? Does it make that? Uh, oh shite! Does it make that this game that can only only adults play? Most likely. As far as I can tell. Did you get the bone? <gasps> yeah, and whew, was it heavy? What's next? Heavy? I checked in the exhibit of royal treasures, and the crown of King Henry VIII is missing. Hmm. Bring it back to me, and we're almost done. One crown coming up. Patey would have a draw, would have a blast, in this place. All right, let's see. All right, make my way to the next boss battle, yeah. Oh, oh shit! I'm just gonna move on before I get hit by toast artillery. Oh, and of course, remember, one of the uh, henchmen are running around. But where? Well, there's the pelt's trap. What a joke! Anyway, even if I did get caught in there. That hole in the side is plenty large enough for me to fit through. Hey, that gives me an idea. And boy, is Lapel gonna be mad. Now all I have to do is jump into that sarcophagus. I haven't seen it anywhere, but okay. Aha! Now the stick snaps, and voila! This guy's a bigger creep than I remembered. <laughs> My ingenious trap. A failure. <laughs> ah, good. The puppy is trapped anyway. As usual, I am victorious. Now, where are you, mon petit chien? <laughs> Poor lapel. Let me out. It is very dark in here. Well, at least his mummy loves him. <laughs> The bad puns. The bad puns. What the hell? Hmm. I could go for the bone hunting again, but I honestly don't feel like doing so. Well, I mean, that was actually a much easier way to get rid of the uh, of the henchman that I expected. Even though it didn't sound like a bigger creep than I remembered. Oh yeah, as well too. In case anyone was wondering, as well too, or even forgot. What's the story of this, uh... Ah, oh, no. Isis is at it again. Shit. The 9-11 incident happened again. But as I was saying as well too, the, the main lore of it actually is that... Somehow, you know, like a... A British couple had like a... Dog couple. Dalmatians. Obviously. I've been hit with the uh, the toast, and I'm just basically tank when he's rolling. <clears throat> what was it again? Oh yeah. <coughs> Wait, did I pass it already? Oh, because you only can go through here, I think. There's a POW over there. Okay, seriously, where the fuck did to go? Yip, yip, yippee! I'm free! I'm trying to talk, but every time I walk around, there's always something to interrupt. But as I was saying, a couple has like a dog, you know, like, and they do the, you know, what nature urges them to do. But by some miracle of nature, the dogs end up having like 102 puppies in one go. Or at least I can remember. And out of nowhere comes a tot named Cruella de Vil. Now, 
you might be thinking, of course, what kind of human being would have the idea of the lore, but it goes like this, that she wanted a coat, a brand new coat, out of Dalmatian skin. And how does she get out of her coat? No more, no less than the skin of the newly born puppies. And apparently, you know, like a... How the hell do I... Ah, oh, that would be too easy. Uh, best get a move before we get an artillery of haste on me. Yeah, there's a weekend go up there, but I don't recall how. Hmm. Hold on. I wanna check in here first. There's nothing up here, isn't there? That's over here where the creep was hiding. But he hasn't said a word of sounds, I think he's dead. Yeah, most likely he's dead. Mm. Fuck. Gonna have to find a way to go up there somehow. There we go, that means there's no way he's down here. But... I think I might know a way. I think, I'm not sure. Hmm. I'd actually like to get over there, but I'm not too sure how. <sighs> right. And there it is up there. Oh no, it's a car. Let the terrorists at it again. We again defeated terrorism. And uh, how coincident, more people double used to rescue. Where'd he go? Only two more people double somewhere around the world. Oh, somewhere around. Mm. As soon as the pharaoh give word, and the stones do as commanded. Well, why not? <laughs> More POWs. Okay. So what was the point of coming down here then? Oh, I get it. I think. Uh huh. On guard. Gotta probably check the walls. There's gonna be at least one more POW hiding around here. Somewhere. There we go. Now where's that shaved the rat at? There he is. Here's the crown. Are we done yet? Not quite yet. You need to find a missing jelly donut. A jelly donut? I'll explain everything when you bring it back. <laughs> Whatever you say, Fluffy. Missing jelly donuts. Hm. We'll have to find out. <laughs> and there is the missing PLW. Ah, uh, thanks for rescuing me. <laughs> hm. <laughs> Really now? Ooh. 
So what's the point of this here? Uh, if you just take a sip, it's, what was the point? Okay, we got the donut. What now? Hey, Fluffy, you ate the jelly donut. Yeah, that's what it was for. I was really hungry. Excuse me. So how do we get out of London? <laughs> well, now we've put all the artifacts back in their proper exhibits, and the night watchman has just opened the back door. <laughs> you can use the back door, and you'll be ready for the next part of your journey. Down through the underground and out of London. <laughs> Thanks, Fluffy. Don't eat too many donuts. And now he's gonna be sick later on, and I'll tell you that. Especially when dogs in the way. Wait. Wait a moment. Oh. Screw it. It ain't here. I'm guessing it's here. Hmm. How ironic. We did it, we defeated communism. The numbers aren't as high, no. What the hell? Hi heck? there. Where am I? The bubonic Bleeding. plague. I am Chester, a rat of fine standing. You are in the London Underground Station, mm. my temporary residence, until my studies are complete. Your studies? studies? What are you going to be, a lawyer? Hmm, strange. Everyone presumes that. But, in fact, <clears throat> I intend to become a successful stockbroker. Work my way up out of the gutter, uh, as it were. That's great. Say, someone told me I can get out of London through here. Any ideas? Sometimes the new tube tunnels connect to the old underground waterways. Perhaps if you could find those passages, they would take you where you want to go. Thanks for the info. I wouldn't trust a rat. It, it, it was what brought the bubonic plague to medieval Europe back then. But whatever. I mean, I have rats in the furry fandom. We got Biscus the Rat, which is basically a popular one by now. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. We got a little teddy bear and a mass shooter. Um. Alright. Something over there, but not too sure what it is. Too pixelated. So, Chester, why aren't some of the lights working? Oh, well. There were short circuits in some of the old electrical lines down here. I say, if you try to use any electrical device down here, who knows what will happen? Anything dangerous? I know for a... Let's find out. The microphones in the information booth are goofed up. But the only dangerous thing in here is the third rail. Don't touch it while it's on, or you could get hurt. I'll be careful, thanks. If we get zapped, be more realistic, goddammit. But saying that the microphones here are all jacked up, eh? Hmm. What the fuck? Hmm. Well, did someone start a post-apocalyptic farm in the, in the underground or what? And where they're both located? Right on top of the electrified rails. You need a hug. Let's play a game. I'm going directly on the side of the site. But it turns around to so slow too. I could use that to my advantage. The third rail, eh? Play a game. 
See you later. What the hell is this? Hmm. Delicious capitalist food. Because Nah, too far away. There's more along the way. Plenty more. This ought to be something. Wait. Give Corella a bite for me. I think they might have hit the dog a little too hard in the head. Oh, bleh! What the hell? No. The hell is that? What do you got here? Hi again, Chester. Going for a swim? I don't know. The water looks a little icky. And I'm afraid I'm gonna not swim well enough. Oh, and the I diseases. swim through these waterways all the time. And the water is actually quite clean. I promise that the water is safe for dog paddling. Even the big whirlpool further on ahead. A whirlpool? Oh yeah, it's great fun. But be careful of Cruella's robot toys. I saw some of them floating around down there. Okay, I'll see you later. <laughs> we'll see about that. Where the hell is this even ghost? Ah, uh, nowhere. Good. I'm glad I wasted my time on that. What's the point of that then? Thankfully, I'm no completionist. Silence. This gamma makes everything a bit easier, a bit. No, just makes it way harder to see. The whirlpool. Okay. Hmm. You use a key on a lock and it just detonates. Makes sense. So when I did all that for... You're a super puppy! Shush! I'm a pro gamer. Didn't get that mixed up. Did I? No, I didn't. Perfect. Then again, oh. Well, there's that. And apparently the rooms are permanently off. The damn camera keeps getting away. This should be something. Hmm. 
Dry land. Time to release the POW. I knew you'd rescue me. Finally. And now... This would be great. Where the hell am I? You're the greatest. My gamer instincts were well, my gamer instincts were itching. So what does a rodent have to say? Hey Chester, where are we now? I'm not sure. But I think we might be in an old abandoned subway station from the Victorian times. What a discovery! Are we near the exit? Uh, yes, I think so. Try to turn on the lights. I'm sure it will help you find your way out. Thanks a lot, Chester. Maybe I'll see you again someday. Kind of sad that a lot of people had many, uh, city just decide to bend what's lost in the sun. She used to abandon what's down inside rather than restore them or whatnot. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let's play a game. Let's try not get a hit. You little cocky fucker. Glad to see you. Off you go then. <sighs> the carnival. Hey. Nine. What's this? Okay. What's this here? Hi, Turtle. Who might you be? My name is Shelby. Isn't that funny? Shelby. I'm about to skip <laughs> the fucking scale. Shell. I'm about Why to skip the scale. Yeah, I kind of thought that might be the connection. Hey, Shelby. What is this place? Why, this is the carnival, of course. We travel around the world, bringing fun and excitement wherever we go. I'm sure you do. Shelby, now you've got me doing it. Hey, is there anything you can tell me about the carnival in just a few short words? Well, you need tickets for some of the attractions. Like the roller coaster, the shooting gallery, and the fortune telling machine. You can probably find some tickets just laying around if you look for them. That's great, Shelby. I'll see you later. <sighs> hey. Wait a moment. I recognize it. That music. Yeah, I recognize it. Mm, my trick knee is telling me. Underneath your bed, you will find a small island in the South Pacific. What the fuck? Alright. What the hell? Hello. Hello. That's one. Hello. Oh 
so I need to go through these or not? I'm guessing so. We'll find out later on. Hey! I'll pass. If you listen very closely, it kind of does have the same instrument as Doom in the middies. So, it's all just one big Doom game, isn't it? I should have known. I owe you one. Hmm. Well. Okay, that was something. Hey! No. Hmm. Hey, Poppy. I just remembered. There's a strange looking man around here. He's tall, skinny, and ugly. That sounds like Jasper Baden. A real creep, all right. Hmm. Thanks, Shelby. I'll keep an eye out for him. So there are communists around the area. I'll keep that in mind. I'll pass. Or should I not? Hey! Not really all that interested in all this for now. Well, mainly because curiosity is mean, for the sake of exploring. What do you got here? Hello, Poppy. You know there's a magic wagon around here with a secret. I thought I had Each bad eyes. You go into it, you enter a different room. Wow, is it real magic? Hmm. I think I'll pass. <laughs> Even on the save button, the saving is quite basically useless at this point. But you know. Dunk tank. Hmm. If I only had a little victim to hmm. a dunk for a dunce. I wonder if Jasper knows how to swim. How oh, ironic. How oh, ironic, ain't it? <laughs> There's the mutt. It's just the sounds of footsteps kind of sound like... Sounds weird. But you can know that he's chasing me. You can't hide from me in there, Ront. Hey, where'd he go? Uh-oh. I don't like the looks of this. Who's that? A poppy? <laughs> and I do so hate the water. Hmm. Ah. I didn't need to need to move that much. Of course, I could have explored the area much more, but yeah, it would have taken too much time. We have to defeat you, find and defeat communism. Hey, Chester, what are you doing out here? Well, the I just sawmill. wanted to make sure you got out of the subway, okay? Besides, my cousin Nigel, uh, he lives out back in the sawdust pile. Well, gee, thanks, Chester. Is there anything you can tell me about this place? Hmm. 
you might want to turn on any equipment you find around here. The that sounds safe. Might shake loose some hidden stuff. Okay, see you later. That sounds pretty safe, all right. So the wood comes in, and bones come out. <laughs> you just know this was taken, taken straight out of Half-Life. I bleh! He was taken straight out of Half-Life, that's for sure. What the fuck? Filthy communist. Ooh, that's from the floor. The fuck you went off to? Oh. I have a few wishes to how, but okay. Hello. One day. Ah, the POW. Way to go. The fuck? I can see when I grunt, but I glitching out from the end. Okay. Hello. Scram. You're the greatest. And then vanished. In that here. On with you go. Hello. No. Hmm. Somehow, I think I don't think it's just wood. If bones are coming out of the wood, I think there's something more to this that I'm not missing. I mean, that I'm... Oh, no. Jesus Christ. One more and I'm screwed. Hmm. You're a super puppy! It's another one about... I knew it. Ooh. Gotcha. I'm just checking around the corner to see if it's all clear. Another one done. Jesus, that tune is annoying. I got an idea. Hello. Trash. No, your place. Trash. Fuck's sake. Oh, for well, Mr. Burger. At least I got that silenced. What do you know? Hey Chester, how do I get out of here? <sighs> Try to use that 
Crane? Yes, but before you can use the crane, you'll have to find the key. Once you've done that, you can use the crane to move that big log. That's how you reach the exit. I get to operate the huge crane? Cool! <laughs> if only we were there. I'd better grab better physics in Half-Life 2. But of course the key is missing. Kinda of funny as well too, I mean... Where there is no one around, is there? Really apart from the dog snatches. Basic. Pretty basic. Right. Wait a moment. Whoa! We must have taken a wrong turn. There's Corella again. False boom. I have the puppy trapped. This new vehicle of yours had better work! I'm not here, my sweet. It's my best invention ever! We're gonna have to figure out some way to stop Cruella. And fast! Hey, maybe we can use these melons. Oh. Oh, so that's how it works. Oh, I hate melon! My new dress! Oh, it's ruined! even more! Right? Ooh, I hate that puppy! <laughs> I think we almost got her! That's the quickest boss bell I've ever had! Right then! Fuck's sake! will spend a week getting seeds out of her hair. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess we better get going. Hey, Mom and Dad should be close. Let's try to catch up with them. Okay, let's go. Should. They don't even know what the hell they are. <laughs> Those cursed puppies have gone too far this time. <laughs> My beautiful clothes. <laughs> Ruined. She looks more like a... It's more like a Half-Life 1 alien. Mr. Bill, it's not all your fault. Of course not. You imbecile! You incompetent goats are entirely to blame! And Lepent, I expected so much more from you. A bit of bad luck, madame, that's all. Have no fear. I, Lepent, will deal with these pesky puppies. Toot sweet. Then why are you standing there like the very idiot? I will not tolerate any more failure. Now get out of my sight, all of you! <laughs> Fosboom, my dot com darling, do you have any good news? Yes, Cruella, the super gloop formula is complete. What do you know about it, Incel? As soon as your army of robotic toys return to the factory with all the captured pets, we can begin the dipping process. And, and why? With the pets frozen in shiny shells of superglue, we shall sell them throughout England as my new line of perfectly realistic animal toys. <laughs> what? And I will become Filthy rich! <laughs> Whew. 
becoming filthy rich in selling. Well. Hello. Oh, no. Filthy rich in selling animal corpses back to their owners. That makes a uh, lot of sense. But then again, you know, again, this tune does sound a bit familiar. It's something that I've. I think I've heard it before, something like Tears for Fears, doesn't it? <laughs> uh, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this one as much as I did, and so... I'll see you guys next time, and until then... I must now kill... Some time... I guess something's done. And I don't even should have done by now. Ah, screw it.